Dear children, hope you all are fine. We are now together for our English language lesson. But before I start the chapter, I am going to show you something very interesting. Hope you will definitely enjoy it. The tiger is resting. The elephant is resting. The tiger and the elephant are resting. This dog is black. That dog is white. This dog is black, but that dog is white. Do you want the monkey? Do you want the bear? Do you want the monkey or the bear? The little girl is smiling. She is happy. The little girl is smiling because she is happy. The sentences that I told you can be joined to form a single sentence. That means we can form a single sentence from the pairs of sentences. We join two sentences with words called conjunctions which is our chapter of study today. Chapter 20 of our English language book. So children, conjunctions are those parts of speech that help us to join words, phrases or sentences. Now let us have a look at the board. See children, as I told you, the tiger is resting, the elephant is resting. We join these two sentences with a conjunction and. The tiger and the elephant are resting. And is a conjunction which shows addition and is used when statements are similar of the same meaning or doing the same work. Next, this dog is black, that one is white. This dog is black, but that one is white. But is the conjunction here, which is used to connect opposite ideas. Do you want the monkey? Do you want the bear? Do you want the monkey or bear? Here, or is the conjunction, which is used to link two alternatives. The little girl is smiling. She is happy. The little girl is smiling because she is happy. Because is the conjunction here which can be used to explain reasons. We will see some examples of conjunctions now. Children, I will show you an abbreviation. If you remember this, you will be able to give conjunction examples on your own. See, fun big boys. F for A and N nor B because B but O or Y yet S so. These are all conjunctions. If you remember this word, you will be able to give so many examples of conjunctions on your own. We can see though, unless, whether, if, as, although. These are also conjunctions. They are used in different sentences for different meanings. I hope you have understood conjunctions. I will give you some exercises on WhatsApp. Try them. Thank you. Goodbye.